Do you call it knees? I don't even know what you would call that. The the, the backwards knees. Wait, is it this the size of a human? There's oh, there's a little blue guy standing in the middle. If that's the size of a person, then it's really huge. Is it really going to be that yeah. big? Good day, Dano friends. Today I do not have that much time, but today I want to look at some of the Easter dragons are well there's only two there's only two coming up but I want to look at what they look like and I want to guess when they're coming I think I can make a decent guess when they're coming okay anyway I just logged in apparently it's my fifth day that's totally unplanned oh I'm going to get a random egg or potion Ooh, what did I get a color shuffle potion that's pretty good, I think. I never actually trade for potions. Like, some people, they trade for potions. They sell their dragons for potions and stuff. I got some of these as gifts or for my daily uh, wheels and stuff. Wait, can I do my wheels? Yes. Okay. Okay. Give me my stuff. Give me my stuff. Give me... Golden apples. Oh, man. I don't actually like having those because I'm afraid I will accidentally feed them. Oh, Fluffy is here, too. Fluffy. Actually, you can spin the wheel from really far away. I don't know if you guys ever tried. You can actually get into the world and even click the wheel from here. If there's not a giant radidon in the way, click from here. Look at that. You can click the wheel from here. 50 revive crystals. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. I'm going to put more crystal plants. Pick the giveaway winner now. Okay, okay, guys. So, last video on Friday, we said we're going to give away a Radidon. We're going to give away this one. And then, then I bred a bunch more Radidons. So, I have a few more. If this uh, giveaway does well, we can maybe do another one, I guess. But this is the one that we're giving away to someone from the last video. So, let's check i'm going to have to check all the comments did you check the comments so the challenge was whoever gives a nice comment about uh fluffy gets the dragon and a lot of people gave nice comments so we have to pick a random person there were a lot of nice comments he says he says thank you for the comments okay i'm going to have to go to youtube and choose a uh, winner okay i will be right back okay so the video has 74 comments right now when i'm looking let's generate a random number one to 74 let's see who is the winner the winner is 21 now i'm going to look at all of the comments Okay, I'm going to count them. 1, 18, two. 19, 20, 21. Okay, so this is comment number 21. It is Brennan, who has a picture of a dragon. So they are a real dragon fan. Is that dragon from uh, the Dragon Prince? I don't know, but Brennan, you are the winner. So add me on Roblox. What is your roblox name add me on roblox or join me on roblox sometime and tell me what your roblox name is on youtube so i'm sure so i know that it's you so it's not a liar who says they are brandon i need someone i need this youtuber to tell me what their roblox name is so i know it's really them and then i will give you the radidon you are the winner of the radidon congratulations he says congratulations brandon so it's time to look at the easter dragons that are coming soon to this game okay so you have to go to the discord again sonar studios and then here at the very top of the easter icon submission look at how many pictures this many pictures people have made for this game that is insane are some people i think some people are reposting is are there really that many it's like a thousand pictures people have made for this game that's insane anyway yeah. There's two dragons coming up there at the very top. So you have this one. That's the popular one. It's basically the Easter Bunny as a dragon, which is really cool. And then there's a flying one. So this one is just a sketch, so it's not as detailed. But, okay, so the primary color is the purple. The secondary color is, oh, the lighter uh, purple. The tertiary color is the horns on the head. And the white doesn't change. So the wings... Wait, all of that white stuff, yellowish white, doesn't change at all? Okay, so that is the flying Easter dragon. I don't really know what's Easter. It's not really much Easter about it, so I don't know why they picked this one. 
uh, to come out during Easter and uh, let's see so the, in red they also drew the mutation so of course it has a mustache again it has one of those koi fish mustaches again uh, let's see it has wait is that ears is an e are ears a mutation Ooh. why does it not always have ears so if it does if it's not mutated it cannot hear okay <laughs> it, can have, it can have spikes on the belly, it can have sort of fluff on the hind legs and something like a fin kind of thing on the tail. So that's pretty cool, except I don't really understand what's Easter about it. I think most people are more excited about this one, but that's because this one has a full sketch. And uh, I mean, this one has like a full detailed drawing and this one does it. Maybe once this one gets a full detailed drawing, it looks as good as this one. But look oh, at wait. this one. What? You right? said um, it, would, uh, it doesn't have ears, but it has a, a set of ears and it gets an extra one set of ears. So it has four ears with the mutation. I don't think those are ears. I think those are more like horns. No, wait. Look at this. I'll send you in uh, your DMs. Oh. Wait, what? Double ears? Okay. Then it can hear extra good, I guess. And it can hear better, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> we yeah, need for a better like hiding eggs. <laughs> yeah, it hides the <laughs> eggs behind its ear. I don't know. I think it's going to look good, but it's just because this is all I have right now. I don't think there are more detailed pictures right now. So I don't have much to go on. But this one has a very detailed drawing. Very cool. So this is the Easter bunny. It's so detailed. Even the tail and the hind legs. Everything looks bunny-like, but not really. Or hair-like a little bit. So if it gets mutated, it gets like a moon on its head. Very cool with an egg in it. Uh, it gets feathers on the back of its neck. Or well, I don't know. I guess I would call that feathers. Uh, and the rest of the mutation. I already looked at them. They are spikes. So spikes on the back here spikes on the belly and spa uh, spikes on the back of the hind legs so like here do you call that knees i don't even know what you would call that the the, the backwards knees it doesn't matter it's it's the bunny easter bunny dragon so it's really cool it has eggs so blue is its tertiary color so if you have a dragon with a tertiary color that is for instance red then the eggs will uh, be red and white or if the tertiary color or material is different than the eggs. If you, your tertiary material is something like ghost white, then the eggs will be normal white with ghost white. So make sure to pick one that has really cool tertiary color. Uh, let's see, apparently the black doesn't... No, wait, black is the primary, the white doesn't change. So everything that is white, like on the nose, the feet, the belly, there are some white parts that uh, never change. And let's see, black is the primary and the grayish, or is it gray? That color is the secondary. Wait, is that, this the size of a human? There's, oh, there's a little blue guy standing in the middle. If that's the size of a person, then it's really huge. Is it really going to be that yeah. big? Also, if it has spikes here, then where do you sit? Because you cannot sit on the spikes. Then you would have to sit maybe here on the fluff on the back, I think. Maybe. I'm not really sure, but then there's another picture after it and it shows more Easter stuff. So there's three potions. So color potions. I'm not sure if I'm too excited. The potions are... I don't know, if you have a dragon that's like pink and another pink and blue. I guess I have a lot of dragons that have those colors already. That's just kind of random colors. But they are kind of Easter-like. But Easter doesn't have really official colors. Like... Um, with Christmas, the official colors are always like white and red and green of things, then it's Christmassy. But with Easter, it's more like every color but bright. So this egg is pretty good. So bright yellow and blue and pink and green, I guess. Because Easter is kind of the celebration of spring, so spring colors. So definitely green and flower colors, I guess. So then, th then you have five eggs here, which I don't think these are the eggs that hatch. I think this is the one that's going to hatch into one of the two dragons. It will be my guess, by the way. A lot of this video is going to be just guesses. Um, I think you could probably collect these maybe to buy this or something like that. Maybe there will be an Easter trader or shop or something or puzzle. Okay, then you can get these potions. I like how this one has a chain on it with... What is that an egg or a heart on it? I don't know, the chain is pretty cool. I don't know. It's really cool. So these ones are probably color potions. So what is the left one? Maybe it's something else. I think it's a special preset 
potion that's that you can only uh, obtain with a fence since the fence potions all have different like shapes maybe yeah then there's a flower like a lotus kind of flower uh, i don't know what that's got to do a chocolate that egg might that be is... actually a uh, farm item like uh, the apples and uh candy or the yeah, valentine's maybe. plant maybe but that's not very eastery is it just a flower i guess it is because Easter is spring, and spring means the flowers come back, so I guess it is Eastery. Then there's a chocolate egg that is open, so I would guess the chocolate bar and or the chocolate egg are kind of like the heart treats that we had with Valentine's. But there's a problem. Hmm. Aren't dragons like dogs? Like dogs? Oh, like they cannot have chocolate? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you cannot feed your dog chocolate, it's poison, and you cannot feed... Well, apparently you can. Okay, so I actually have an idea. But I don't know if this is true, this is one of my ideas. In this video I'm going to say a lot of things that might never happen. I think maybe the flower is what you farm in your base, and maybe it will have the chocolate eggs on it. Like, the, the flower is like this yellow things coming out of it what if at the end of all of those there's like an egg or something oh that's epic idea maybe i don't know it's just a guess because in, you are right like they're probably going to make another plant just like with valentine so maybe it's that and then the chocolate so then this would be like the heart cookie and the chocolate bar will be like the heart treat kind of I don't know, we have yeah. to speculate. And also, I want to take a moment to speculate on the release date. So a lot of people say, is it coming out today? <laughs> is it coming out tomorrow? When is it coming out? Um, now, I'm going to say my uh, uh, an easy guess would be that's definitely coming out on a Friday. Lately, all of the events, uh, ev events, all of the updates have been coming out on Fridays. They're just sort of making Friday into their like official update day. So if Easter is on the 12th, then maybe it comes out next week or the week after. If it comes out the week after, then it literally comes out only two days before Easter. So that would be a little time before Easter for you to actually collect the stuff. So I want my guess would be next week. That would be my guess. But if not next week, then definitely the week after. And I think on a Friday, uh, that's just my guess because the last few updates, the Wasteland, the Wasteland Dragons. Um, then last week we had the uh, Traveling Trader, Traveling Merchant, also on a Friday. So they're just making Friday their official uh, update day, which is really nice. So we know when we can expect new stuff. Okay, was well, there something else that I was going to do in this video? I don't think so. I just I don't have that much time today. What else? Let me quickly look at the Discord one more time, see if there's anything. Oh, we could have a look actually at some of these drawings. So a lot of people are drawing. Um, wait, so they said each week of the Easter fun. So that means that the Easter event actually lasts multiple weeks. I don't know how long it's going to last. I hope very long so everyone can get their Easter dragons. Uh, we will update the game with a new icon created by a fan. Um, it has to be an Easter picture. Well, that, there we go. Here we have a bunch of pictures that people have made. There's so many, so I'm very quickly going through them. Uh, this one is nice. A little bit more wintry colored than Easter. So since Easter and, um, and the start of spring are the main themes, I would say this one is a little bit... It has snow and stuff. Let me scroll down a bit. These dragons are not very detailed, but I still like them. But they're a little bit like sketch, sketch like, I guess. Okay, so they're this one is. Style. What, what did you say? They are a different style of drawing, I think. Yeah, I don't know. everyone has their own different style because it's different people, but you need to at least make them a little bit detailed. Um. Uh, I like this one a lot because it shows the, both of the dragons, it shows all of the items, the one by Brian Nasky, uh, it shows some of the eggs, it even shows a potion, it shows the uh, bunny dragon with bunny teeth, which is really funny, like it really looks like the Easter bunny. Um, they could have maybe made the Easter uh, bunny dragon some other colors, because of course those default colors are just to give you an idea what it could be. So you, I would like it if it would have more Easter-y colors. I guess maybe I will just give m one of my Easter potions to it. But yeah, like a soft pink and yellow and blue or maybe something like that. Let's see. Then we have one here with a flower on its head. 
Uh, let's see. <laughs> this one is holding a basket of chocolate eggs. Oh, man. <laughs> I want to look at all of them, but today I don't have that much time. And there's also like a thousand. Like, we've already scrolled past 20. Even the worst one of these is like a thousand times better than I could draw. Okay, so I like this one, the colors in the letters. Adventures. This one is very winter themed again. People make it... Look at the words. They made it all blue. So I just think some people think it's still like winter, but Easter is supposed to be like uh start of spring yeah the plants are coming back wait did you send me something yeah oh that one is good that one is good like it has all the little flowers that come back in spring and stuff yeah oh this one is nice pink blossom flower in the back looking for eggs a little egg basket very nice this one is cool with the eggs the dragon is a little bit vague so i think they want the dragon bigger because of course this picture is going to be really small once it gets into roblox it's only like a very small small picture so it has to be a picture where even if it's really small you can clearly see that it's a dragon so i think when people make it like this small it will look bad when it's even smaller. Uh, oh, these are adorable. Look at the kawaii eggs on this one. Uh, eyes, I mean. The kawaii eyes by the second Kang 3350. What? Kawaii dragons. Oh, what is this? Oh, it has a bunny in the background. Wait, will there be a bunny mob? That will be really cool. Except I don't want to kill it. Oh, and even the <laughs> letters are like different colors. Oh, I really like these letters. For some of them, I mostly like the logo. How they changed the logo. I really like this one with the hairs. It's really detailed. Let's see. Oh, that one is nice. That one is nice. It has the egg and the stars. That one is good. Yeah. You are farther down than me. I'm still scrolling. <laughs> Once again with a basket of eggs. That's a really nice idea. A lot of them like basket of eggs. But yeah, you have limited things that you can put in there. Definitely think it should have flowers. Maybe butterflies. Maybe some eggs. But also, it should mainly... One of the most important things is that it looks good when it's very small. So if it's too detailed, then you cannot really use it, you know? Oh, yeah, man. but... These are also can good... I just... Oh, look at this. It's holding the egg and it's collecting more eggs. And they made the eggs the same eggs as the one that the Easter Bunny Dragon has on its back. This one is really good. Can't keep up with you. You're scrolling faster than me. I'm trying to get through. <laughs> this one is funny. There's like a gacha girl in it trying to feed the dragon some chocolate. Uh, the Easter Bunny Dragon is even sparkly. This one is very good. But of course, once it's very small, it's harder to tell what it is. The official logo is like just, it just says Dragon Adventures. Very clearly it shows the head of a very big dragon right in the middle. And then the background is not that distracting. And most good games have that if you go to the games page on uh, Roblox. Like they just very clearly show something like Welcome to Bloxburg. Literally just shows a guy waving like, hey, welcome to Bloxburg. Because if you put too much, like this one has a lot in the picture. Uh, then you have no idea really what's going on in it because it's even on my screen is bigger than most people uh, Have it a lot smaller like it has to look good even when you okay That is a little bit too small. I zoomed out way too far like uh, dinosaur simulator is a good one You very clearly see the two dinosaurs and it says DS dinosaur simulator Oh, this one is funny that one dragon feeding the other look at the eyes. It's like ah, it's being force-fed eggs It's like no, uh, uh, I don't want to eat more eggs. I already ate too many <laughs> This one is not even square. I mean, it's a very good drawing, but it has to be square. Very cool, though. I love, once again, I love that they changed the colors of the logo. I wonder if they, if the makers of the game like that, or if they're like, don't change our logo, how dare you? Oh, this one even has uh, baby chickens, baby birds. That is another icon of spring. Okay, well, I'm only halfway, but I really have to stop recording this video. So, yeah, a lot of these, well, pretty much all of these are really good. This one is good. I, th I hope they use this one. This one looks like one they could use, because very clearly in the middle, uh, the only thing is that the paw goes over the text, so that's uh, so people can't really read it. Let's say if people have never heard of the game, and they don't know what it's called, then they might see this and they'd be like, Dagen... It, it, they might it might be harder to read that's really the only problem other than that this one is really good 
because it's going to look really good when it's even when it's really small when you see it from uh or well not from far away but on your phone when all the pictures are really small uh, by the way i'm talking about one by typlosion for life o oh and it what? has the other dragon in it but very small in the background it kind of looks like spyro like this <laughs> it had it has the eggs i love the way the clouds look with the little circular shape anyway I think I'm going to have to stop recording this video because I have to uh, edit this for today. I had to make a quick video because the only other recording that I have right now is when I was playing Rec Room with Green and that's like an hour recording. So I didn't have time to edit all of that today. I bought a full green foil wasp, which I really like. I think that looks it's pretty cool. Big. It looks like a mantis. Yeah, yeah. It's a... Uh, oh! It literally just, oh, it just <laughs> so but this is the one that we're giving away it's literally called giveaway so we're giving that away to brennan so brennan if you're watching uh leave a comment telling me what your roblox name is and then join me okay but you have to s first say it on youtube so otherwise i don't i'm not sure if it's really you okay let's see oh it's yeah. still a baby okay it's still a baby should we give away this okay maybe in the next video we'll see if the giveaway works and if it works, we'll give one away in the next video. Because I don't want to be one of those YouTubers who's literally just give away and not other content, you know? Like, there's, oh, a, yeah. there's a fine line between being a YouTuber who likes to make videos and sometimes does some giveaways. Or a YouTuber <laughs> who only does giveaways because they can't think of video ideas, you know? Some people, they just do videos. Omch! Is it you? Omch! <laughs> yeah. It's me. Omch! <laughs> gaming plays shout out to gaming plays yx oh my god oh my god <laughs> okay we should end this video they don't even know they're in the video it's a little surprise okay okay that's the end of this video thank you fluffy for being here and for the giveaway dragon and thanks everyone else for watching don't forget to stomp like a dinosaur Super big thank you to everyone who supports me as a member on YouTube or a Patreon on Patreon. Their names are on the screen right now. Thank you friends so much. Without you, it wouldn't be possible for me to make these videos. If you also want to support the channel, the links are in the description. And if you don't have any money, you can just share this video and like and subscribe and do all the nice things, especially just be a nice person. Thank you so much. Don't forget to stomp like a dinosaur.